This video is sponsored by HelloFresh. HelloFresh's goal is to build food solutions with the least possible impact on the environment. Use the link in the description below and use my code for 21 free meals plus free shipping. That's HelloFresh. This person says, Meta Cooler, their favorite Dragon Ball Z movie. I love the Goku and Vegeta moments. Mm. That was a good movie. It was a good movie from what I remember. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, I like it. That's one of the movies I want to rewatch. To be honest, it's been a while. You know. Yeah. You ever get like you ever get like that feeling where it's like, yeah, it's been too long since you've watched like shit you used to watch like all the fucking time. You know what I'm saying? I saw this. <laughs> I saw this clip um somewhere. I think probably like Twitter the other day of like Boo and Kid Boo and Super Saiyan Goku fighting it out, and it was just like such a perfect clip. I was like, damn, I gotta watch that shit again. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, the good old days. Because like everything, everything going on lately with Dragon Ball is not making me been enjoying it lately. Just that's fair. Teach their own. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> the fucking shaking of the heads, man. Oh my goodness, that is so fucking funny. Um, but yeah, I mean, Meta Cooler. Yeah, I, I, I. The cool. So fun fact, I have a playlist called Anime Push on spotify right and it's basically a playlist that is filled with songs that they're either from anime or make me feel like they could be in mm. an anime right and they they you know when i have that shit on they help me fucking get it right and one of the songs that's in that's in there is actually from the cooler movie where goku literally when he turned super saiyan Right? I was gonna say, he is it when he healed the bird? Yeah. Yes, 100% when he fucking healed the bird. 100% when he healed the bird. Because, bro, you cannot tell me that shit was not raw. That was OD. He did the Jesus no Jutsu before Naruto. So, that bird was fucking dead. So are you saying that, that that's the one that gets you hype? Like, OD? Oh, well, it's one of the moments. Okay. It's one of them. Okay, yeah. okay. Because I was gonna say, yeah, like, nah. mine, mine for, like, for gym shit... Mm. My skin is cold. <gasps> That's mm. <laughs> 21. No. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Trapped with that... this somebody. Morals and no. I don't even know what the fuck they're saying. I don't care. <laughs> because guess where that movie? Said, guess where that song care. is from, Brandon? Guess what that song is Oh! Dun, 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 dun. My soul! Dun, 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 dun. Come on, come on, come on. You, just one word. Kakarot. Come on. <laughs> Sad. <laughs> that song no, from the first Broly movie, of course. If in case you could, you guys couldn't fucking get the sing along, right? Yeah, those two, those two songs are in there. That one is in there. The one I'm talking about is in there. And it's so weird because, like, I remember one time I was, I forget what machine I was doing. I can't remember if it was, if I was on the ab one or if I was doing a leg press. And as soon as, I think it was a leg press. Because as soon, you know, the, you know, the part in the drop where, like, you know, for the, for the cooler moment when he heals the bird and shit. And, the, and like, I don't even know the lyrics. Of course, I don't know the fucking <laughs> lyrics, right? <laughs> I just be, I want to change. <laughs> and you. <laughs> Yo, dude, when that part came on, yeah. I said, <gasps> I just fucking pushed that shit. I had three plates on each side. Fucking leg press. Shit was, oh. I, I saw that moment. When, when, yo, that shit was so sick. This is what I mean. You look at, you look back at Dragon Ball Z. Yo, Dragon Ball Z has some raw shit. That's like OD. Like a part of the reason why a lot of these moments that we remember are so fucking raw and hyped and like OD is because of the, the selection of music that was used. Yeah, yeah, you know, yes, like sir. I will always, I will always, I'm not even going to say I'm going to die on this hill. Okay. Cause I'm going to living, I'm going to live thriving on this hill like the thriving ozaru that we fucking are okay because like we're not the only ones that grew up with listening to all these fucking dubs in the first place and all those movies had their own soundtrack that featured like 
bands and like you know artists that were like you know they were not like actual japanese composed like pieces and obviously dragon ball z dragon ball they were all made to fit a east more eastern kind of show and 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 it, and it shows because when you look at anything from that time period from like the 80s all the way through the 90s a lot of the anime especially with dragon ball z and dragon ball they had that very like you know the horn like all that type of shit yeah. the same thing exists with godzilla same thing exists with super sentai same thing is it with common rider ultraman they all have they all share the same type of properties and that same similar sound where it's like their version of heroic shit is like that over there so when they brought it over here they felt like that shit wasn't gonna hit the same so that's why they added a lot of rock and metal and i mean look at little remember fuck it rock the dragon <laughs> come on son yeah, no, people don't dude, people do not give that song enough respect everybody's all about fucking uh what, what the 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 class the, the everyone the sha la hey sha la like yes that's a that, like, i am not shitting on that song I That's, got tired of that shit. Not Which one? <laughs> Shala. Oh, you did? <laughs> After a while, yo, that shit. Mm -mm. Yeah, but see, right, right, right. So it's like you hear that all the time. You hear the remixes. You hear people's versions of it over and over. And then, and then one day, watch, pop in, rock the dragon. That shit's gonna hit different. You're gonna, you're gonna start noticing. You know, eh, 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 eh. You're gonna be bobbing a little bit harder to that shit. <laughs> that shit was fire. You know what I'm saying? Like shit like this. We can only have in our version. So I guess the moral of this whole thing that I'm saying right now is like what you like and don't hate on the fucking dubs. Okay? Just don't do it. Because <laughs> the majority of the fans right now, because, yo, and funny enough, and this is a fun fact, and you can take this and apply it to anything. You can tell how old somebody is based on what they tell you. I mean, don't ask Geek them because he's biased. You know, he, he's going to tell you like, oh, yeah, I want to watch it in Japanese because those of you haven't watched it, right? Like the real version. Which and that's is, the thing truth too is like that. they because of the music it brings such a different vibe to it you know because like yeah. rock the dragon is you know metal type music it's very like head bangy type part shit then you hear fucking mm. chala like it's, it's not the same <laughs> shit <Carlton. It's> just... <laughs> <laughs> he fucking carlton <laughs> oh shit yeah it's just not nah. yeah no that's facts that's that's 100 because like when you when you when you think of it like this, you know, like you you can't deny, like oh, like what I was gonna say before was that you can tell someone's age if they tell you that a lot of this music that obviously we grew up with, and like we're not all the same age, right? But like if you grew up with watching Dragon Ball Z, okay, you're not gonna hate on any of that music. Right. You might you might if you're a purist. And then you, after the fact, discovered the original shit and with all the original audio tracks and all that stuff. And if you're the purest like that, whatever. You like what you like, you got that, that's fine. I enjoy it for different reasons because I know how to appreciate everything. But you can tell someone's fucking a youngin if they're straight up out the gate, frame one, they're like, yeah, no, all this shit sucks. <laughs> and it's like, oh, okay, so you're gonna tell me, you're gonna, t you're gonna load up Broly 2. You're gonna load up second coming DVD and you're not gonna leave that shit rocking for 10 minutes? Cause you remember how that shit was. Broly 2, yeah. Yo, I remember when I popped that DVD in for the first time. It was at dad's house. Had a big ass fucking CRT fat fucking TV. <laughs> that shit was so big. That shit that was TV huge. Was thick. It was 50, it was one of those 55 inch Johns, but they had the fuck that shit. Oh my God! It Pause. was like, yeah, yo. But why? Why was it so big? Why? Why? But that was the technology back in the day. They, now everything's yeah, flat. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Had that shit in, popped in that shit, and of course, Dad had the surround sound. Of course, he did. Okay, what Dominican do you know not have surround sound? That's crazy. You know what I'm saying? This man had the whole shit. He was ready. Popped the disc in. I heard that music, Kai. We couldn't. We we. It I didn't hit rap. play for like. It, I didn't hit play for like five, ten minutes. I was letting that shit. Damn. I was like, yo, this shit is crazy. 
I can't believe why. Like, yo, there ha this shit has no reason to be this hype. But guess what? Dragon Ball Z Foundation. See, see, that's how you bring back. That's how you bring back DVDs and shit. You gotta make the menu music slap. <laughs> yes, yes, and that's kind of. I low key wish that, like, for dubs, I wish that they explored with using unique music for the English version or you know whatever. You know what I'm saying? Because I feel like that would make ours, you know stand out a little bit more because when you think about it, it's like well if we're if we're if we're gonna adapt the original and we're gonna keep all those things like you know script and intention and characters if, as I mean, long as those things are all the same they'd be fucking that shit up all the well time. no that's what i'm saying if, if yeah that's what i'm saying like if all if all that shit stays intact there really shouldn't be any reason why they couldn't like explore or just go back to how they used to do it for us when we were kids because all i'm saying is that shit would be fucking sick if we had obviously like if you want to watch a japanese version you watch a japanese version you get the japanese score but yo imagine if we got a score for that was different that wasn't you know just japanese because you know like they you know everyone understands where it comes from but i don't know like i just i guess this is me just I miss how a lot of that shit sounded. And like, come on, the Super Saiyan 3 track is very, very strong and still popular to this day, even despite all of the criticism that Bruce Falconer would get and all that shit. You know what I'm saying? That's it. I, I just I just I just miss that rock sounds for, for Dragon Ball sometimes, you know? Mm. I don't even remember how to you, you, we had to play we had to press play on that shit. For what? DVDs? I haven't, I haven't, <laughs> I haven't watched nothing on DVD in so long. I don't even remember no. <laughs> <laughs> That's crazy. This is coming from Wait, the. This is coming from DVDs the. DVDs have chapters too. You'd have to like select what part of the DVD you'd want to skip. Yeah, to I don't. If you were coming unless back you to were it. hitting play all. Huh? Unless you were hitting play all. I forgot all them fucking options. <laughs> Dude, I, I just thought you popped the disc in. <laughs> boom. No, you really don't remember. No. I haven't, yo, I haven't touched what? the DVD in years. Decade. Yeah, well, okay, <laughs> for you, yes, probably. I feel like the last time you popped a DVD in was literally what I'm about to say. You, this is coming from a kid who literally religiously watched every single orange brick disc mm -hmm. from start to finish on repeat. So he would go through all nine sets. Yeah, but he never got a chance to done, see the menu because as soon as it would end, he was just playback. <laughs> <laughs> yeah right yeah. but yeah that see now that's that's crazy the fact that you don't remember how just a movie works like you just put it in the fucking player I seen it in fucking <laughs> that is how crazy the world is now mm -hmm. yo we're all everyone's on netflix, netflix hulu, hulu crunchyroll, crunchy something. disney plus nah, hulu really slapped though especially for anime anime people yeah who, who's in there a hulu bit. really holds it down I've only literally I've <laughs> I only used Hulu recently. I've only used Hulu for Bleach. That's the only thing I would have to I had to use it for, to be honest. Yeah, I mean, I was always flip flopping between Netflix. I'm just glad I didn't have to get fucking Disney Plus for Bleach. Because oh. that, that was a time. That was a time. Remember? Well, the funny thing is, it wasn't like they were totally false, but it was more or less that Disney Plus Japan is what has Bleach. That's what it is. So, like, if I was the VPN that shit right now, I could, you know, be like a fucking, well, I don't even know what you call them shits, a, a, a hipster. It's like, look at me, guys. I'm watching Bleach on a Disney Plus. <laughs> no yeah. So, all right. I think, uh, yeah, there's more comments, obviously, but... Blood war on Disney Plus. They really got me fucked up. Yeah, because I don't know if they have Hulu. I mean, I don't see why they wouldn't, but I guess, you know... I don't know. Like, I don't know. I I know that Japan has their own, like, uh, subscription-based service for anime. I don't. Ju I just don't know what it's called. But I know that they have one. But, you know, everything's about rights. You know how that shit goes. Oh, that's that good shit! <laughs>